If you needed a tow truck this morning and had to wait a while, this may have been why. This convoy of tow truck operators drove down the DVP and descended on Queen's Park. This contract is going to put out a whole lot of independence out of business. He's referring to the decision by the Ontario Provincial Police to contract out a chunk of the towing on our highways, which is expected to go into effect this summer. There are roughly 1,100 licensed tow truck operators in Toronto, a few thousand across Ontario. The majority are independent. These tow truck operators paint a bleak picture once the contract is awarded. Presently, the tow operators give a zero to five minute response time. If this contract comes in, especially in Toronto, that response time for the, comp the big contract towing companies could be 20 minutes to 30 minutes after the police show up and order a truck. They argue this will create congestion on the side of the road and more likelihood of secondary accidents. To clarify, the awarding of the OPP contract will affect the towing of vehicles that have to be seized and impounded because of alleged driving infractions. For example, impaired driving and a violation of the street racing law. The OPP estimates this to be only about 10 to 15 percent of the towing that's actually required. Any other type of towing on the highway, whether it be a disabled vehicle involved in a collision where there's no impoundment, we always ask the, the operator first if they have any towing preference. The Minister of Community Safety says while the tow truck operators are free to protest, she questions why they needed to tie up traffic on the roads to do so. It's unfortunate and I hope that they will uh, uh, instead of doing that, that they will make a bid for, uh, for the contract. Anthony Robart, Global News.